everyone, I hope you will be fine. Fatma Graphics is here with another new video. Today we are going to create this design according to Defense Day in Adobe Illustrator. Let's get started. We have to create a new document. So go to File, click on New, add the name of the document. The width is 1920 and height is 1080 pixels. Change the unit into pixels. The color mode is RGB and the raster effect is 72 pixels per inches. Click OK. Now here is our new document. We will design an aeroplane. Select the ellipse from shape tool. Draw it on the artboard. Now select the star tool. Press the down arrow key to turn it into a rectangle. It will decrease the number of corners or anchor points. Decrease its size from the top anchor point and set it on the ellipse in the center like this. Now we will add two anchor points on this triangle. Go to the pen tool, select the add anchor point tool and add the points on this part. Now select the direct selection tool and choose the anchor points which we have created. I have to choose both points, select the first point, then hold the shift key and select the second point. Press the up arrow key to get the shape. Now make a copy of this triangle by holding the alt key and drag and adjust it at the end of the ellipse. Now decrease the size and adjust it. Now draw the rounded rectangle shape. Adjust it in the side of the plane. Make a copy by holding the Alt key and set it like this. Select both the shapes. Use the Shift key while selecting the second object. Hold the Alt key and drag it. Keep selected the object. Go to the Rotate tool and select the Reflect tool. Right click with your mouse by holding the Alt key. The dialog box will appear. Select the vertical option. Check the box to see the preview. Click OK. Adjust it on the right side. Select all the shapes. Go to the Shape Builder tool. And drag the mouse within the shape like this to delete the lines of the shape. It will convert all the shapes into one shape. Decrease the size and rotate it. Go to the pen tool to make these curves line. You can check the pen tool video. There is a complete method on how to draw it or how to use it. Just click once to create a first anchor point. Then click and drag it. While clicking hold and drag it like this. If you click on the anchor point, it will delete the second hand. Now you can adjust the curve easily. Make two more curves lines by following the method of the first one. Just click once to create a first anchor point, then click and drag it. Click on the anchor point, it will delete the second hand. Adjust them in the center. Now we will create a moon and star. To create the moon, select the ellipse tool, hold the shift key and alt both keys and draw it. By holding the shift and alt key, a perfect circle will be created. Make a copy of this circle by holding the alt key and drag it. Decrease its size, adjust it like that. Select both of the shapes and go to shape builder tool. Hold the Alt key, drag the mouse from the outside of the shape. It will delete the shape where you will drag it. Decrease its size by holding the Alt key and shift together. Create a star with the star shape. The final step is to add text. Type the text. Change its style to bold. Double click on the text, select the September and change its style to regular. 
add the text change the style to bold increase its size i am changing its position you can adjust it as you like it's totally up to you the main objective of this tutorial is to learn how to create or how to draw now create a rectangle for the background image to send the rectangle back right click on the artboard go to arrange and select the send to back option change its color to white select all the shapes use the shift key while selecting object change its color to white now we have to apply gradient on the background go to fill menu and select the gradient patch go to the window select the gradient and swatches menu select the left gradient slider hold the alt key and select any color do it same for the right slider go to the gradient tool hold and drag the mouse like this and adjust it where you want i hope you will like this video don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel see you in the next video thank you